Hi guys! It's February! And it's my first ever January favorite. If you don't know me and you haven't seen any of my videos, my name is Essence of Shay. Welcome to my channel. Let's get started. So, the month of January is kind of like my trial period. Like I have all these goals I want to get set. Rushing into January and trying to do all these goals, starting them in January gives me anxiety. So I don't really start in January. I mean, I started a few things, but I'll let you know okay first things first is this rose water this is beauty rose water wa um mist thingy madoodly i use it on my face my face gets really dry and a lot of things don't work as far as toners and stuff goes so i use this and it brings my skin back to life it makes it a little bit more subtle supple supple <laughs> heritage store i just got this off of amazon it was like seven bucks not bad winter i get a little dull in the skin i'm dark skin and all of the dark skin beauties you know how it is summer is our glow up time but winter we get like ashy and our face looks dull so i got this nars um illuminator that i've had for a while but i use it more in the winter and it adds that winter glow to my face that i cannot get no matter how hard i try but this helps very much i usually i'll mix it with my um, bb cream or foundation or i'll put it on my skin first let it absor absorb the glistening factor and then i'll add the rest of the steps so this must have this is my dr bronner's peppermint soap this is a must-have for me like i need it i need it to shower to wash my hair to wash my clothes if i want to hand wash my panties a little bit <laughs> is a 32 ounce bottle and this cost me about 13 dollars i heard that you can get it cheaper i don't know where they get it cheaper but this right here it's an all-in-one thingy madoodly and i'm telling y'all i have a video coming out with my holy grail and i explain to you why this is a must have in anyone's home get you a pair once again i get really ashy i'm not i don't have eczema but especially the winter like summer i'm okay i could go out with not even lotion in my skin but the winter time when i say the the skin looks cracky and dry honey like you could write my name on my skin and i don't know why this happens and it's so freaking annoying but i've been trying this palmer's cocoa butter formula moisturizing oil which has sunbeam sesame and safflower safflower say that three times fast don't judge instantly relieves and dries skin i use it as soon as i get out the shower i put it on my skin on my damp skin i let it sit on my skin for a while and either i just leave leave it like that or i just pat dry my skin for any excess oil and let me tell you the first couple of days i was like eh. but after a week I've seen major results. This and Palmer's cocoa butter or even shea butter mixed with some coconut oil. I just gave you some secrets. Get you a pair. So why do I keep saying a pair? I don't really break out, but during that time of the month, <laughs> when the little creepy crawlies like to pop up on your face, and it doesn't pop up any other time of the year but on that time of the month instead of me doing my normal i put a, a, a q-tip on the top of this this is tea tree oil this thing right here you bad honey you bad she knows she bad just put a little dollop on it it's like a zit kung fu -er. so my next favorite is this bag and this is from Zara. This is a bag that I rock every single 
thing. You know when you have that everyday bag, you just grab for it, it makes you comfortable, it sits right up here nice if I want it clutched close to me. Leather and it has gold features, which I'm obsessed with gold. Maybe that's the Indian in me. I love it. She's perfect. Yay. I told you guys at the beginning of the year that every single year I will be trying something different. And I told you that I will crochet and that's what your girl did. This looks like I haven't started, but I literally just clipped it off. Like you could see right here that it was clipped off. I literally just clipped it off and I made, I'm gonna show y'all what I made. I can't find the other ones that I did. They're all over the house. And my grandma probably threw them away cause she was irritated with all my knickknacks all over the place. But this is just one of my creations. I call her a coaster for your cup or a little decorator for your candle holder thingy mabob. You wanna sit there and judge me? I am really proud of myself. I'm proud of myself. Even if you have a cat, look at the de look at the details. Like you <laughs> The, the hate is real if you have some negative to say about this. Next on the list is my Essence of Shea necklaces. Essence of Shea is a, a conglomerate of different things. Jewelry, fashion, music, hair, everything. So just seeing the name on me means that I'm being more serious about my brand. And I got this from Melanie Marie. I've been rocking it since I got it and I've had it for about two months now I shower with it I everything with it it gets a little tangle because I put one shorter than the next I just like it that way can you see it yeah so my next favorite are and a lot of people would say that these are ugly but if you live in New York they're kind of a staple and these are my Uggs I love them. They're a little dirty because, like I said, I wear these almost every day as well. And I love them. They're comfortable. They're quick to put on. Last but not least is music. I don't know. I've been feeling so inspired. And the 90s, I felt like, made me happy. Tony Braxton. I've been listening to Kanye West's first album especially his song never let me down oh we all here on a for a reason on a particular path you don't need to know the curriculum to be a part of the math cats think i'm delirious but i'm so damn serious that's why yo yo i can't listen to kanye west drop out i think his number six or seven never let me down that song gives me chills every time i listen to it it takes me to the core of your everyday life it's never let me down don't let anyone stop me from doing what i was meant to do on this earth no Th this is another video i've been going through a lot and i've been letting other people control me in a sense and listen to this song reels me back in they say music is the best teacher out there. I am the one to tell you that this is true. This song has helped me on so many levels. Anyways, without me preaching, this is my first January favorites. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you like what you see. And I would like it if you subscribed and liked my video. That would be great. But if not, that's fine. I will still throw more content out there. Please, 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 please have a blessed February. And I'll see you next time with February favorites. Okay, bye guys.